Hey guys, it's Monica. I am going to hopefully do a very, very quick video that I'm going to reselect a winner for my Nivea because my lovely winner had posted and given me hearts and, and emojis and all that and I just assumed that she wanted to be entered into the contest and she didn't. But the funniest thing was Apparently she had written a comment on that video and I didn't catch it and so she reached out to me via email and she said you probably haven't gotten my messages but I um, I really didn't mean to enter I just wanted to show support because I love your videos and all that stuff so anyways I'm redrawing that but I'm you're gonna crack up when you see what happened. You really, really will. I'm gonna insert that clip just in a few minutes. But I just wanna tell you, this is the contest I had for the Nivea Skin Firming and Smoothing. I also did the Bee Venom, and I had selected two winners, Random Picker, or at least a YouTube random type of picker, had selected the two winners, and the package went out for the Bee Cream that this was the bee cream it's already gone in the mail and this is the Lana Court bee cream the one that you get in TJ Maxx it's very very hard to find I absolutely love 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 this cream I've been using it since November of 2016 and I absolutely love it so that went in the mail and other package went in the mail actually three packages went in the mail today and now tonight I have reselected a winner for the Nivea so stay tuned and you will see that. But before I do that, I'm going to tell you that, um, and I know I've mentioned Octoly before how much I really like the fact that you can actually select products that you're interested in. And I am a Boots Number no. 7 fan. Most of you know that I absolutely, one of my favorite foundations is my Number no. 7 Lift and Luminate. 99% of the time, I gravitate towards this foundation. My second favorite is my IT Cosmetics CC Cream. The IT Cosmetics CC Cream is a 50 SPF. So on a real hot sunny day, if I'm gonna be wearing foundation, I probably will grab that because of the SPF factor. But my Boots Number no. 7, I absolutely love this foundation. On my skin, this works really well. Now, if you zoom in on me right now, you're gonna be going eek. I am like in a, I'm going through a massive flake and peel. Nothing is going to help my skin at all. But I saw on the Octoly Network that number seven had Airbrush Away Tinted Skin Perfector. And I was really intrigued to see because I absolutely love my number seven Lift and Luminate. So I requested this and I was approved and I received it in the mail. I've worn it for a few days now. For me, and it even actually says this, this is sort of like a, um, a velvet or a satiny finish, which I really like. And for me, I put it on, it's almost like a primer in a sense. So I put this on all over my skin. I have the, I have the shade medium. I just wanna show this to you. Let me see if you can see that. I don't know if you can see that. When I first opened this up, my first reaction was, oh my gosh, it was way too dark. It was. It was like I looked at it and I said, way too dark. But take a look at this. I'm putting this, I don't know if you can see. Look how that, look how that just blended. Can you see how that just, I don't know if you can see it, but I hope you can. Anyways, it just blended into my hand and it also just blended into my skin perfectly. So I really, really liked it. So anyways, I left the house this morning. I put this on as a primer and then I used my Boots Number no. 7, my Lift and Luminate. I did that because I need a heavier coverage. It's a very light sheer coverage. I think this would be perfect on those days when you just want to even your skin out and you just want that kind of a finish. So I put this on top and I think around one o'clock I went in for a meeting and before I did that I have this um, big magnifying, little magnifying glass. Big. It, it should be big because when I look at myself I go, ooh. But anyway, so I looked and I still had a really decent coverage. I did have to powder down a little bit, but that's not unusual for me because I do use 
an oil on my skin before I put any foundation and also because of the fact that I'm peeling so bad I need that oil but I think this really held up well and again I used it more as a primer and then I put my regular foundation in spots not all over the place but in spots I have like no foundation on my forehead I just have this you know my cheeks and all that nothing I have it basically on my nose this is where I would put my foundation I might try to even out some of my uh, my red veiny things, but anyways, not too much helps that. But I am really enjoying this. So this was gifted to me from number seven via the Octoly Network for in, in exchange for a review. And my honest honest opinion on this is I actually do like it. Will it take the place of my Lift and Illuminate? No. Can it be a great addition to? Yes. I do like this for the light coverage and how it evened out my skin. I thought that was pretty cool. So I'm really pleased with this. I just want to say super, super thank you to number seven for sending it to me. I've worn it a couple of days now. So far, so good. But this is still my favorite. Absolutely still my favorite. So that said, I'm going to insert my clip for the winner. <laughs> and let me say, Will my new winner, and I don't want to give it away yet, but will my new winner please reach out to me via email? You can email me at realtormonica, M-O-N-I-K-A, at gmail.com, or you can leave me a comment, but reach out to me and let me know your shipping information. I am going to be going out of town for vacation, so if I don't hear from you before I go, you probably you know probably won't ship until I come back but check out what happened and poor and I have to say the person who had was selected first was Mary Reed yeah Mary Reed and um, just watch the video and congratulations to my new winner and thank you Mary for being such a super super wonderful wonderful person love you all bye guys and so here we go thank you to Mary Reed for I guess not wanting to win this originally and that allowed me to oh my gosh look who got selected again <laughs> oh my gosh Mary Reed this is just too funny I'm going to have to go ahead and redo this somehow okay there it is starting all over again I'm going to key in the video and hope for the best I can't believe Mary Reed won twice <laughs> Here we go. Who's it going to be now? Who's it going to be? Robin. Oh, awesome. Oh, and she wants to try the farming Nevea. Awesome. Robin, reach out to me. Let me know your shipping address and I will get that out to you as soon as possible.